This is what Linda Perez looked like Monday morning. This is a picture of her now, clinging to life after a breast augmentation procedure. And her friend, who drove her to the Coral Gables Cosmetic Center, doesn't want his face on television. He saw Perez unconscious, being wheeled into an ambulance, and then he started asking questions. What did the doctors tell you? He was telling me that everything was okay. That's, that's a, a normal process. That's to take her to the hospital is a normal yeah, process. Yeah. They tell me that. The anesthesiologist who tended to Perez was Dr. Mario Alberto Diaz, and court records show he served time in prison back in 2006 for illegally dispensing at least 53,000 doses of pain pills over the internet. He eventually got his medical license back and started practicing again. Lo que me entregaron fue prácticamente un, un vegetal. Mariela Diaz, Perez's mother, told us, quote, what they've given me is my daughter as a vegetable. Perez slipped into a coma after the procedure, and her father told us the doctors at the cosmetic center never told them what went wrong. Dr. Jacob Freeman performed the surgery. Neither doctor is commenting on the situation, but their attorney is, saying in a prepared statement, we at Coral Gables Cosmetic Center are committed to upholding the highest standard of medical care and patient safety. For privacy reasons, we cannot comment on any medical Medical issues related to its patients. Linda Perez has a three-year-old son. Tonight she is in a coma over at Mercy Hospital. Her folks say they're hoping for a miracle. Reporting live from Miami tonight, I'm Steve Litz, NBC6 South Florida.